Hey guys, good morning, how's it going? I hope you guys doing good. It's N.T. Pino, the producer. Uh, welcome back to another piano lessons. And uh, we're almost at the end of the scale. We're almost starting the end of the scale. Today I'm going to be covering um, key of B flat major, or you could call it A sharp, right? So, all right, A flat or, or B sharp, so. So the other day we did, um, uh, we covered the key of A major. All right, and now today we're doing this. All right, guys, so we almost, you know, uh, after the B flat, we do B flat, we're gonna do the key of B. And after that, it will be the end of, uh, you know, us uh, studying the scales. And then we're gonna move on to the next topic. All right, guys. Uh, I appreciate you guys for you know sticking with the program. And uh, today we're gonna break down the key of a uh, B flat, B flat major. All right, guys. So if you have been watching what we've been studying, we start with the scales, and uh, and then we identify the how many black keys we have that kind of help us you know what i'm saying recognize where we're going especially you know what i'm saying if we want to know the scale and play you know what i'm saying in the scale so let's start with the uh, um you know the, the scale real quick I guess so that's the scale of uh, you know what I'm saying B flat major or you want to say A sharp major. All right, guys. So this is a pretty um a simple key. So now the second thing we're gonna do is uh also don't forget the finger exercise. Right, guys so <clears throat> don't forget the finger exercise so always you know what i'm saying reason why you want to do that because you get to flow in the key it allowed your finger to be fast you know what i'm saying so you You develop, when you do stuff like that, you develop a muscle memory. It's just like going to the gym and working out, and then, you know what I'm saying, you're adjusting weight. So, same as the fingers, you know what I'm saying, to be good. Once you practice every day, or, you know, you know, a couple of times in a week, I understand people have jobs and people are busy and stuff like that, but, you know, once you make an effort to practice every day, you realize that you have muscle memories. So, you know, you can move freely because you adjusting that weight every time you add the rep, you know what I'm saying, you become, you know what I'm saying, now you're able to lift this one, 35, you know what I'm saying, 40, you know what I'm saying, 65. So it's just the same thing as the piano, but it's different. You know, I, I hope you guys get the comparison. All right, guys, so now uh, let's identify how many black keys we have in uh, B flat major. So let's see. Okay, so now we have two, all right? We have one. Which is gonna be uh, B flat itself. And then we're gonna go to D sharp or E flat. All right, guys, so this is pretty simple. You know what I'm saying? 
you know, instead of, you know, the F, the, the C sharp major that have, you know, five, those five keys. Now this one is, uh, you know what I'm saying? So pretty, um, pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? So uh, now, <coughs> What we're gonna do, the exercise I always teach you guys, uh, which is the chord exercise, which is the one, three, five, one. You know what I'm saying? Once you identify that, you can start playing the chords. All right, so uh, let's start with this. So to do that, since this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, sorry guys, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. So now to identify the, the one, which is uh, B sharp major triad, right? So which is one, two, three. One triad means one, two, three. So, right? So B sharp major, what B sharp, uh, B sharp major, B flat major, sorry guys, B flat major triad. So we got B flat itself, we got D, and then we got F, right? So that's the first one. Now we're gonna look for the third one, the third the, the third chord that we're gonna identify here. It's very simple. One, two, three. All right, which is D, right? So that would be D major. All right. All right. So D major, and then now we're gonna go to um. <laughs> sorry guys, uh, sorry guys, so So I'm gonna count one two three All right guys, so one two three, so this is gonna be D minor, right? D minor and uh, I almost I made that mistake. I, I think I'm gonna leave it there so you guys can see uh, I did this it's D minor, right? Which is gonna be the second. And then now, one, two, three, four, five. The five will be F sharp major, right? F sharp major triad. And then we're going back to the one. And remember, I always do this. All right, so let's do it again. So, one, two, five. One. One more time. One, two, five, one. One, three, five, one. All right. One, three, five, and one. All right. So, um, let's try some real quick. One. that you could do that but it depends on what kind of song you want to play too because you'd be like damn why are you adding why are you adding this key right f sharp mid f sharp uh but f sharp is not part of the the you know what i'm saying the scale because it's d major right but d major is right and you're playing the right which is number two but it got to be minor because reason why it's minor also i'm gonna leave that first part mistake that it's not really a mistake but you know just leave that part right there so you guys can see uh, because we now in the key we now playing the key of d minor right it sounds in the key and then we're going to f all right so I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to go from there. So um, pretty much we cover the chords and uh, you know, once you are home and stuff like that, you know, just practice.
know what I'm saying? It's plenty of exercise. So, you know what I'm saying? This ain't this ain't no science or anything like that. It's just you practicing every day. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, uh. guys so I right, so this is uh you know I'm saying the key of uh, you can either call it B flat major or you could call it a sharp uh, you could call it a sh <laughs> you could call it a sharp uh, major all right so that's it for the you know what I'm saying for for this lesson and uh, like I said, for the next uh, tutorial, it will be this will be the last, uh, you know, what I'm saying um, lesson that we're covering the scale, which is gonna be B major. All right, guys. <laughs> which is gonna be B major. All right, guys. All right, guys. So you know. I uh, appreciate you for being here. If you like this video, like, comment, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next lesson. I appreciate you for tuning in. Peace.